Hello, all my fit friends. Welcome back to another gym workout. Today, you're gonna get set up at the cable machine and I'm gonna share four awesome abs and oblique exercises. So you're gonna grab a rope attachment and something to put your feet in. That happens to be one of those arm hanging thingies that you can hang off a bar to do hanging abs. And you're gonna get set up in that plank position with the um, one foot attached to the cable machine there. And you see, you're gonna tuck the knee in to your chest and then you're gonna do a wide spider plank tuck there. We are gonna go ahead and do as many as you want per side. I did 10 per side. You really want to make sure you're really staying strong throughout your plank and avoiding hiking your hips up. So you kind of find that sweet spot of the height of, ha of where um, the cable machine is hanging, that attachment is hanging. But just hang tough there. You can do it really focus on squeezing those abs and obliques. So you're gonna make a quick adjustment and you're gonna switch to the rope attachment. And you can see I've moved the cable pulley up because we are gonna do kneeling weighted crunches. So with this, you wanna keep your back flat and you're hinging from the hips there and you're just drawing your chest towards the ground. Now these are great to also play with the rhythm and you can do eccentric motions where you go down really slow and return up to the um, top position really slow and you're really gonna feel the burn that way too. Today I just did a regular tempo of like one to two counts down and up and you're gonna bust out 20 of these. Pick a weight that's challenging for those 20 reps. Then quickly, you're gonna take off the rope attachment. I went lighter on the weights here, and this is gonna be an anti-rotation move. Anti-rotation means you are avoiding rotating. You don't want your hips rotating. You wanna to try to keep your hips square to the front as that arm goes across your body. You're really gonna feel the obliques with this one. The obliques are what um, are helping you stabilize and avoid rotating those hips and knees. So you're gonna make sure you do the same amount on each side. I did 10 per side. Really use your breath, exhale as it comes across your body, and never, it's so easy with abs exercises to want to hold your breath, make sure you're never holding your breath so that you don't feel dizzy. All right, so to finish off, we're going to go ahead and lower it to the bottom, and we're going to do some weighted side bends. So this was an eccentric move. So I pulled over strong and then I counted to three as I let myself bend in towards the cable machine there. So that eccentric motion is just adding time under tension and making you really control that side bend. And again, you can play with it. Like I, I came over quickly and powerfully the other direction, but you can make that go slow too. Play with it, see what you like to do. Every time you go back, you can try something different. And this is the last of the four exercises that I included in my ab circuit, circuit here. You're gonna to wanna to go ahead and do at least three rounds. Try to do it with as little rest as possible to really challenge yourself. And you can add it on to any workout at the gym. Lots of people like to do abs with cardio. That works out great too. So I hope you enjoyed these four exercises. Let me know below if you liked them and if you wanna see more abs workouts at the gym. Until next time, always remember, no excuses, no regret. Just sweat everybody, bye.